I want to go back to cancer a little bit. Um, from what you've seen, how much does things like chemotherapy and radiation uh, affect the body and then in turn change or affect their nutritional needs? Sure. We'll start with most cancers are very um, difficult on the body in and of themselves. And so the medications are therefore appropriately difficult on the body because they actually have to destroy tissue um, in many cases um, or change the way the body functions in a very foundational way. So they're, they're very harsh. Um, with that said, some of the chemotherapies are you know, heavy metal based and that has its own set of problems. The, the bout of cancer, going through cancer treatment is a uh, struggle physiologically. Um, so it's, it's fantastic when we can get them through that stage um, and then be able to kind of retreat them um, maybe a little bit different way. I talk about it in terms that patients really understand. Say, you know what, sometimes there's, the building got on fire and you got to gut it and we got to really do some major, almost more damage to some extent. And then you come in and you rebuild. And after you rebuild, then you can redecorate. Let's not redecorate when we're still in the rebuilding phase. You know, a lot of people, uh, I think, will start to look toward alternative treatments, especially if they've gone through that once. Do you see that and, and find people that have success with different cancer treatments? Yeah, and there's a lot of the natural treatments from, a, from an evidence-informed perspective. I mean, they're really, they're promising, but none of them have really been tested with the rigor that we need. So when I work with people that I'm close to or, or patients who have had for a long time and now they've come in with a diagnosis, you know, the knowing which way we're going to aim on this is really important. Some individuals will say, I want to go 100% natural to my cancer treatment approach. And I usually have to say, that's not the way I would probably go. You know, there's a lot of great things that have happened in conventional medicine. Let's try to use the best of both worlds. Let's talk and be open with our oncologist and our naturopath, nutritionist, chiropractor, anybody that you're working with. Be fully transparent about what your real wishes are and how you want this to go down. And let's start there.